Lauding the judgment as one that is actually deviating from the ones of old, the guests said calling for a fresh election was not the best the tribunal could have been able to offer even though it was okay. The guests, who are Professor Richard Idubo, Dr. Sylvester Uriere and Austin Osakwe said if the appeal court upholds the judgment of the lower court, the issue of having faith in ESIEC to conduct election in Eastern Northeast local government area by the people in that locality will leave more to be desired. The judges there relied on their hunches and reached the decision they reached. They would have missed the point. But if they relied on the hand law, that by empirical evidence, admissible evidence to reach the decision that they reached, they ought to be applauded. They ought to be. When that election was conducted, there appeared to be a preponderance of opinion mm. that palpable injustice had been done, that there had been a miscarriage of justice, mm. that fairness had not been applied squarely to one of the parties. The, the veracity of the essay as it is now left more to be desired. Okay. And as such, the Eastern the, the people, the Eastern Northeast people has already lost confidence in the institution. On the issue of the suspension of CBN Governor Sanusi Lamido Sanusi, the guests attempted to look at the constitutional implication of the action even though there was no provision in the CBN Act of whether or not the president can single-handedly suspend the CBN governor. The guests also dwelt on whether or not amnesty should be extended to members of the dreaded Islamic sect Boko Haram among other salient issues. Politics Today is a current affairs phony program aired simultaneously on ITV radio every Saturday from 10.30 to 11.30 in the morning. A full Wangwe reporting.